This is an overview of managed file transfer and its evolution by Han Business Solutions. Here you will learn about MFT, what it means and what it does. At Hand, we understand that you want plain speaking, so we explain confusing jargon. We don't just understand how networks work, we understand how business works. We will help you to understand your own needs. So what is MFT? In the past, individuals and institutions used File Transfer Protocol, or FTP for short, the traditional FTP solution for moving files between two points. Why then do we need MFT? Let's look at the evolution of file transfer. Companies would have used the sneaker net in the past to move large files. They would have been copied to floppy disks, CDs or other portable media, then physically transported across the room, across the road, across the country, or even across the world. Then the recipients would use the files on their own system. But how did business get done like that? In addition to the obvious costs involved with time and transportation, there's little control over data security. There's no surefire method of auditing the data that leaves an organisation. How many times in the not so distant past have we seen headlines like these, where personal data has gone missing, or private and secret information has been found on discarded disks or stolen laptops? What would the effects be on your business if sensitive information was made public or fell into the wrong hands? Certainly you risk a loss of reputation, and most probably a loss of revenue. There's also the question of civil or criminal liabilities. So, out of necessity, FTP was invented, originally to move files from a single system to another single system. This was fine for small businesses and for simple transfers, no transfer costs and near instantaneous transmission. Then came email, which enabled transfers to multiple or single recipients. However, email is limited by the size of file it can be sent, and also by the extent of control that a business can exercise over its use. So, some organisations used email for fast and simple communication of small files, or FTP for large files. But here's a question, why did businesses continue to spend time and money on couriers to transfer really important data? The problem with FTP and email is that it is, that it is still insecure, like the sneaker net. Email is largely uncontrollable, and only used for small files, and FTP does not have a method for encrypting data. A determined attacker could sit silently on a network and pick up data, usernames, passwords, etc. This security risk inherent in FTP gave rise to SFTP and FTPS, two different methods of encrypting data, known together or singularly as secure FTP. Now a business could send large files between systems, but still only point to point. This is where MFT comes in. Managed file transfer is exactly as it says providing a centralised and an audited transfer solution. As MFT has evolved through organisations with many tra transfer needs, the whole process of collection and distribution can be coordinated centrally and automatically, and with files being managed centrally, there is now visibility with full reporting and auditing capabilities. In its very latest form, Business to Business Integration, or B2BI for short, MFT has been enhanced. It can manipulate data, performing processes that will translate data forms between systems. It's possible, for example, to make external data presentable to internal systems, or vice versa. We have seen how file transfer has evolved. At Ham Business Solutions, we provide the very latest in managed file transfer solutions to help your business evolve.